Hello everybody, welcome to the channel, I'm of course your host, Almino5373, and well, in today's video, we will be playing in the VK45.03 in Gravity Force. Now, how I had this idea, because I was thinking this morning, what are tanks I have not played in a while? And the only tank that could pop into mind is this tank. I believe the last time I played it was in my video. So yeah. Have you ever seen a flying VK45? If you haven't, you're definitely gonna see one today. Let me turn my, down my game volume, because it is very high. But, what's good and what's bad about this tank? It has bad armor. Let me get that over with. But, when you're in a Tiger 1, which is the counterpart of this tank, you have a massive lower plate and everybody can pin you, so it's just fine. And you have a massive turret in the uh, Kapua, um, in the Tiger 1. But it has nice alpha, a nice reload. Everything is nice about this tank. It has decent speed. But, oh boy, is it going to have fast speed today. Because, yeah, it's gravity force. And we already flying off. And if I'm right, this tank does only weigh 45 tons. That's why it has the 45 in its name. Which, uh, yeah, lucky him. He gets thruster. Hee <laughs> hee. But I can fly too. Mm-hmm. Yes, I can fly. Um... Well, I was going to try to get a shot into, like, this KV-3, which we still can. No idea how that actually did miss uh, this helipad. Okay, everybody's just going too fast for me to hit them. Because, of course, it is gravity mode. And uh, we can go ahead and miss our shell into you. Oof, he just... I feel bad for him. But we can put on an auto-aim. And just shoot this guy to death. Nice little fire there, killing him. So we are actually bouncing, which is a miracle. And if you like this tank, you can get it right in the store for, uh, I don't actually know. It's a good, good bundle, and it also comes with the VK168. But if you just want the flat out tank, you can get that too. No camo or anything. No idea why we switched to HE there. And then I'm not going to try that. But, um, so yeah, pretty good so far on this game. I uh, probably, yeah, I was going to say probably not even 1k damage. Um, but if we poke here, now we have 1k damage. So yeah, this guy's not doing too healthy no more. And before he can shoot us, we can finish him off. So that's both of the SUs that I've killed. And then this guy, we're going to mobilize, which I totally meant to do. Um, and then he'll just get yeeted so I can't shoot him. But yeah, all that's left is the Hellcat and this T23 E3. It's pretty good from the vk45 now uh this guy he's going to get shot yes there we go killing him <laughs> yes more damage for me putting on auto in there i'm missing my shell on the hellcat uh yeah which hopefully we can clear this guy no oh okay we, we still have a chance uh, oh no, that was bad. That was actually bad. Uh, we can take off auto aim and tap this guy. Yes, there we go. 152 damage, 4 kills. Pretty hasty amount of damage. And that's the BK45 in, uh, in gravity mode for you. So yeah, the stink is pretty decent. I recommend. It's for all of you who do not know that the tank actually exists. We can check here. I do think it's, yeah, okay. 
It's, oh, well, you can't buy the VK45 um, on its own. But for 8,000 gold, that is pretty good. Um, so, yes. We will do one, two more games, I don't know, on whatever time we have. But, okay. So, a bottom tier game. It does, I have to admit, struggle a little bit bottom tier. Now, I will be pushing with the mediums because... Yeah, I don't want to go to that hill and get YOLO rushed by that VK168. That does not sound fun. I may e might even play a game in the VK168 uh, after this one to show you guys the strengths of that in gravity mode too. Since they're selling both. So, we can hopefully get into the game or it will not let me in. Okay, we spawned on this side, which is fine. So that guy is gonna miss. Um, we can tap him for zero damage and get a ghost shell. Um, because that's my luck. Um, so yeah, this VK one six eight, he's gonna get shot right in the back of the turret, and we will put on adrenaline. And just keep on tapping this guy for 200 damages. Yeah, he's he's not going to like me too much after he's dead. There we go. Nice high roll. Uh, and there we go. He's already dead. So, yeah. Nice shots out that we did get um, this Annihilator. Oh, we can switch to premium ammo and absolutely ricochet. Our shot on the tiger too, but we can push up to this hill with our great mobility, 50 kilometers per hour, since it is gravity mode and the rules differ. Um, nice mobilization shot on that guy, this guy, he's, he's oof, oof, <laughs> he's not doing too well, Bonk. That okay, no idea where that shot went, but we did get a shot into him. Now, I believe this game is going to have more damage than the other game. Now, where did that stir mill go? Oh, uh, okay. I was going to try to hit that 87, as you could see, but apparently this game didn't want me to. Uh, so, when this guy comes down, we can out or, or he'll just get yeeted. Um, but, yeah, that and I later, he's not doing too well. <laughs> nope. We are going to do more damage this game because uh, we were top tier, and you know, when you are top tier, there is more HP. Ha 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 ha, he died in a funny way. Um, but this AT7 is all that's left, and we are still full HP, so we should be able to deal with him. Now, he does have a very quick reload. Yeah, he's targeting me because he's weird like that. Um, okay. So we can push up here and fly, fly away. Yes, a flying VK-45. That's what I want to see. Um, but this guy, he's just going to get ricocheted. Um, this guy, he's going to die for me. Yes, you cannot beat the mighty El Nino 5373. So more damage than last game. But granted, I did absolutely from the vk168 at the beginning talking about vk168 we can do that right now there we go Yee. so this is, this is it one more time because we end so now we can talk about the vk168 which is Massive tank, 168 tons, and it struggles. Let me tell you that. Turret, the cheeks are penetratable. Kapula, penetratable. Lower plate, penetratable. You can even penetrate the front track wheel if uh, it's angled in this one position. And But the one thing it does not struggle on is HP and alpha. There are only few tanks that have over 2,000 HP at tier 8. It's the VK168 KV5 T32 a mil and a mil 1, I believe. And yeah, 
there's a ton of tier 8 heavy tanks, and out of all of them, only those to have over 2,000 HP. I don't know why some people don't have the extra HP years. Um, that was bad. I meant to do the front track wheel things that I was talking about. Now this Panther 8 point- the, Oh! Oh! I was gonna say Panther 8.8, but then I realized that was always Panther 2. Now can we ammo rack another KV-5? Yesterday, I ammo racked a KV-5 and a KV-5. Now this Panther 2, I feel bad for him. Because we are, we, we rammed him? Yep, there we go. Oh, he tricked me. But you know, that's how things work in this game. But, since he cannot, oh. Or he does that. I was going to say, since he cannot gain mobility in the air. Um, well, this guy, he's just going to get pinned right there. In the capula. And then rammed. <laughs> So you can see what this tank does in this mode. It just, it, it's the definition of ramming at tier 8. That's what it is. It's a mini mouse. Uh, I know they call the mouse chin that. But, but oh boy. Oh, is that an AFK T34 too? If that is, we are going to absolutely crush him. It's a miracle from heaven. Look at this. Look at this. Yeet! <laughs> uh, I feel bad. Um, well, he's dead. And then you are going to get slapped for zero damage. Mm -hmm. So I want to actually know where the Sarachim Bullzik is. He could be somewhere where we don't know. He could be in plain sight and we haven't spotted him yet. I honestly have no idea. Oh, wow. I, I meant to put on auto aim there. But uh, apparently we can hit him through the grass. Uh huh. So where is the Sarachim Bullzik? That's what I really want to know. Is where the Bullzik is. There he is. Just playing around in the back. Mm hmm. Common. But, uh, yeah. Judging that he is just doing whatever he's doing in the back. He doesn't have a spall liner. And that SU is probably just going to tap him and yeet him. Though he did strangely, like, miss his shell twice. Um, so this guy, you're going to get shot. So you can't use your ability, and you're just going to get plowed into an existence. Now, where this guy is, is he's going to... Oh, mm -hmm, I was going to try to ram him. But uh, if this object continues going... No, he's not. They're just going to face hug both of each other. And so, yeah, the object will get heshed by T49, or T49 will miss shell. Or I could just completely ram mine. Oh, hmm. that was bad. Um, okay, well this guy, he can't go anywhere. That's what he can do. And he's just going to get rammed. And rammed. And rammed. There we go. He's dead. There we go. No more, uh, no more tanky. So that's what's so good about the VK168 and Gravity Force. We will do one more battle in it since two battles. Ooh! Five thousand damage. Okay, he did six K. That's pretty good. Yeah, I, I knew he would have a lot, but yeah, six five K damage in a VK one six eight. A whole bunch of ram and damage. Yeah. Uh. Huh. <laughs> huh. Yeah, five K. Just by ramming. 
Last game did 5k only ramming low. There we go. So we can uh we can drive over here and see what tanks want to play with the alpha of VK168. This guy does. Oof! 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 Wow. 1k damage. 1k damage just by that little ETBT tap. Now you're dead. Yep. Bye. Say goodbye to your career because you don't exist anymore. Um, now I want to ram this in 103, though I don't really want to because I know he has a better gun than me. And our team is being overmatched by the Reds, but this guy, he's gonna thunk. Yep, he's gonna get thunked. We only took 100 damage from that, which is impressive. Oh. Ooh, well, we can angle this, yep, so that he bounces. He was trying to do the front track wheel strategy of pinning the tank. Uh, but this RHM Bullzik is going to die. Um, he did shoot us, which wasn't too good for me. Um, we can angle here, so that guy doesn't shoot me. Okay, well, we ricocheted, which is just fine with me. Uh, okay. There we go. Angling in a nice, juicy position. Now, he's going to try to poke out here, but we are going to let him know he is not welcome here. No, he is not. Now, we are doing a bad job at angling. I was going to say doing a great job at angling so that, I mean, fair play. He was struggling to do that um okay so oh oh whoa whoa, whoa. Oh, 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 oh. oh we are not dead yet now we can go up to this guy so that he doesn't pin us out oh. and i was gonna say completely rush the vk100 so if you liked today's video make sure to leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you all later. Bye!